Hey guys, it's Erin from Metasolve here to talk about Medicare CQMs. Medicare CQMs are a new collection type available in the Quality Payment Program in Performance Year 2024. They are only available to MSSP ACOs reporting under the APP framework. A Medicare CQM is essentially a MIPS CQM, traditional MIPS CQM, except that it only reports on the ACO's Medicare fee-for-service beneficiaries instead of the all-patient, all-payer, um, all-practice eCQMs or CQMs. This only considers your fee-for-service beneficiaries assigned to the ACO. Now, how are they assigned to the ACO? Not in the traditional way that you might think of with assigned beneficiaries in the MSP model. Instead, CMS is going to use the CQM specification way of assigning the beneficiary. And it has to do with the reporting period as well. That's how CQMs are specified too. So Medicare CMS will give you a list of your beneficiaries at the beginning of the year, but it won't be inclusive of everyone because you could have beneficiaries come in and have a claim that have the Medicare fee-for-service beneficiary as designated on their record, and they would be considered, and that might not be in the files that CMS gives you at the start of the year. So when you're considering what you're going to do going forward with your um, measures, keep in mind that CMS has already indicated in this proposed rule that these are transition measures, that they intend to eventually retire them and push all ACOs reporting under the APP framework to go to either eCQMs or CQMs. So as you build out and consider how you're building that out, keep that in mind that these aren't going to be forever measures. All right, that's all for now. Hope you have a good rest of your week.